can we get your evil eye? Because you have evil eye. Oh my god. It's not gonna look as good because I don't have the. No, it was off to the. It was one of those over the shoulder. So evil. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. How did you do that? Well, I spent a lot of time in front of the mirror studying my facial expressions and how I was gonna pull off being possessed. Like, you no, know, I was was I gonna do a narrow eye and make it look evil or a wide eye and make it look creepy. So I spent a lot of time discovering that. And you know, when I first became aware of the script and and I read it, I something in the back of my mind just clicked and I instantly started building my character and I thought it was so cool and unique that I got to play somebody possessed. So you're on the set and it's dark and it's made to be intentionally creepy. Ever for a split second feel real? Um, for no. sure. No, I mean, you're like, no. Well, not for Natasha, but I mean, for Emily, when I was really into my character, it definitely felt real. I mean, I, this was real life, but I could, I could turn off um, my character, I mean, it was just another character for me in a way that I was acting and that's what I love to do and it requires me playing different characters, so it was really fun. So when you have hours and hours and hours of downtime on a movie set, which is kind of the norm, what's your favorite gadget that keeps you sane? Well, I didn't get too much, um, well, probably my iPhone to begin with, but I didn't... Why? Because I have all the cool apps. And Give me two or three cool apps. Um, Twitter, mm -hmm. Instagram. What's your Twitter handle? My, my username? Yep. N Natasha Callas, at Natasha Callas. All right, well, we're going to tweet you this interview. <laughs> Thank you. Give us one more app. Um, let me see here. I like Cut the Rope. That's fun. That's addictive. <laughs>